How glaring is the 12 men left on base? <laughs> I mean, come on, man. We take nine runs all the time. We're swinging the bats well. We had one game where we got shut down yesterday. Other, otherwise, we're, we're having the right kind of at-bats. Um, you know, they kept us in the ballpark other than DJ there at the very end, you know, and that's that's a difference. But, um, I mean, we, we, we keep having those this level of at-bats and contributions up and down. Yeah, we'll be fine. How encouraging was it to see Glaber and Hicks have the at pass that they had? Yeah, it was good. I mean, you know, Hicks, he gets a reward, a couple, you know, a couple squibbers there to kind of get him on track and then smokes a ball, works a walk. So that was good to see. And, and Glaber, Glaber coming around, having some good at bats too, you know. Um, you know, hopefully that's something that gets those guys jump started too. What did you see from Montas in his debut? Just having a hard time putting guys away. You know, it started right, at the, right out of the gate. Um, you know, had. Uh, you know, I think 0-2, 1-2 uh, to Carlson there and hangs a split base hit and he's two strikes to to the next guy and hits him, um, you know, and then and then when he came out there in the second, you know, when they had the big inning, uh, walk, walk, you know, and the walks are something that, that really hurt us today, obviously. Aaron, him not pitching in 10 days, do you think it has some kind of an effect? Uh, yeah, yeah, you know, but it also could have been, you know, yeah, uh, you know, that's not ideal. You know, we talked about, you know, just his situation, obviously getting traded, um, you know, his, you know, dealing with, you know, the family stuff he's had to go through the last few days. Definitely not an ideal situation for him. Um, but that said, you know, I think just as Ely could have come out and, and, and dealt, you know, um, but but certainly a tough situation for him. And But he wanted to be out there. He wanted to compete. We felt like he was ready to go and, um, you know, got this first one underway. And he's, he's going to he's gonna do big things for us. Did you guys give him the option of taking an extra day because of all the travel and everything? We just, we just talked through it, um, you know, kind of, you know, from the start of things, like what made the most sense, you know, when his last bullpen was because he was in line to pitch maybe – you know, Tuesday or Wednesday at home for us. Um, so it's hard going back on the timeline. So we're just kind of what, what made the most sense of being able to get him a couple of pens. Um, so it, it worked out to be this date. So we're all we're all on board with that. The fact that he was, I think he hit 97 in the first inning. Is that encouraging that he's perfectly healthy? It was, you know, just maybe. Yeah, I mean, I mean, he flashed all the things you get excited about today. Um, you know, he just wasn't wasn't real sharp. You know. Um, you know, finished finished pretty well. Thought his third inning was was his best inning, where he was you know on the attack and uh, able to have a clean inning to get through that. So, um, you know, it's it's on to the next one. The Brady was uh, commanders just but lately he's been getting hit hard. What have you seen from him? Well, that 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 second inning came out. Um, you know, he came out right away with with really good command, and then kind of, you know, lost a little bit there um, in that second inning of work, where, you know, we just couldn't shut them down. You know, we scored a couple to tie it, get right back in there. We, you know, need a shutdown inning, and just, you know, that's where the game got away from us a little bit. You know, with the inability to finish guys off, and and you know, our strike throwing wasn't great that inning.